Hey, what is up everyone? My name is KB and welcome to Clubit. Today, I'm going to show you some of the best and must have Google Chrome extensions. So without talking too much, let's dig into it right now. So the first extension, we have the momentum and it is an amazing new tab. Uh, extension whenever you click on new tab you will have this beautiful window where you can see the time after, and after that it will tell you good afternoon and say it your name you can see my name is KB Karki it is saying good afternoon KB Karki if it's morning it will say good morning if it's night it will say good night so that's an amazing thing you can change the backgrounds from setting here and you also have a to-do list where you do some, you can write something and make your to-do list so and you can also set something like uh, your day what you want to do today so i'm i'm gonna say i want to sleep okay I just, it's just for fun okay enter enter and your today today's task is this i want to sleep because it's rainy day so i want to sleep after this okay <laughs> and whenever you're done with this you just click on that you can see it's completed and it will say good job you know this momentum extension is amazing you can see you have beautiful dashboard you have a beautiful background you have everything you need it's just amazing it is a must-have uh, extension for google chrome i will put link in the description for this extension go there and get this and let's head over to our next extension next one we have the chrono download manager it is a download manager for google chrome you know default download manager is not that great you know of the google chrome you know that so you can download this and make your new download manager within the google chrome so you just tab on the icon you can see what is downloaded already it it has a support of like you can pause and resume the downloads so that is the amazing thing simply you have a download manager inside the google chrome you can clear you can see just by one tab you can see what you have downloaded previously you can do the pause and resume thing so it's a, it is also must have extension for you I will put link in the description for this go there and get this and let's head over to our next extension next one we have the floating player for YouTube twitch and Netflix so uh, when you go into the YouTube or any video site you can tab on like you are watching the video you can tab on the icon of floating YouTube it will give you the floating player and after that if you want to play it in a floating player only so you just go right click and you will see open link in pop-up so it will open the link open the video in pop-up so this is really cool uh, extension for if you watch the youtube videos or twitch videos or maybe netflix i will put link in the description for this go there and get this and let's head over to our next extension next we have the advanced notepad and this is just like the notepad in your pc so now it's in google chrome so you just click on the icon of advanced notepad and after that you can see you can write some stuff here so i'm just gonna write i am reviewing something i didn't mean to uh, sing but i'm just singing <laughs> okay so the it is just like the notepad you know in your google chrome so you can back this up if you write something it is very important you can cloudly back this up and after that restore it so amazing i will put link in the description for this advanced notepad go there and get this and let's head over to our last extension last one we have the https everywhere this is a security type of extension which makes your browsing secure for that you have to learn about this so https is a secure way to surf the website if the website has a https then that means that website is secure and uh, if that website doesn't have a https Yes. for example this one this doesn't have a HTTPS if you input your information like uh, bank card information or something like that you know some useful information that can be stolen that can be hacked so uh, you should use this you know uh, if you do online shopping and that kind of stuff see if the website is HTTPS or http only so for that you use this extension and uh, when you use this you just click on the icon and you can see enable https everywhere it will force try to force the website to have a https if doesn't have then it will load in http only so if you want to uh, block http which cannot be used as a https so you just click on block and now see 
I want to browse this. This doesn't have a HTTPS. It has only HTTP only. So now it will give me an error. It will give me an error that your connection is not private. So something can be stolen. So something like that. So even though if it is blocked, you can go in advance and proceed. If the website is only HTTP, don't input your information like bank card information or something like that. Do not input that the kind of information. So for example, mine, my website is a, as you can see, HTTPS. My website is a secure and you don't have to input anything. You don't have to uh, input your bank card information or something like that. But you know, uh, if there is an online site where uh, you see HTTPS that means that is okay if you are buying something there is no HTTPS do not buy from there okay make sure that there is a HTTPS and uh, yeah this extension will help you to identify if the website is HTTPS or HTTP only so yeah this is just for security reasons I think that's all for this one guys that's all I have today so I will put link in the description for all of these extensions go there and get them all and uh, tell me which one you like the most and yeah I will see you in the next one take care of yourself and have fun bye bye